To look at them, you'd never know it, but these ants are fungus farmers. The leafcutter ants of South America are the epitome of teamwork. Living in colonies of several hundred thousand to a million, each ant has a specific role to play within its colony. And each one of them depends on this fungus to survive. The relationship between the ants and the fungus is exclusive. Neither one is found in nature without the other. The ants cut discs out of leaves and carry them to underground nests. Then they shred them and use them for growing the fungus. Inside the huge subterranean fungus gardens, thousands of ants work to cultivate the fungus for food. The ants cannot digest the plant molecules in the leaves, but the fungus can. So it grows and provides a source of food for the ants. The fungus benefits from this arrangement too. The ants provide it with a constant supply of food. Each ant in the leafcutter ant colony has a specific job to do and knows how to do it instinctively. The largest ants are the gatherers. They brave the outside world to cut the discs out of leaves. Then they carry them back to the nest. The smaller ants take over. They shred the discs into minute pieces, mix them with their saliva and add them to the garden. The smallest ants care for the fungus garden. They transplant bits of fungus from an older part of the garden to the newer part to promote growth. They add their saliva to the garden and walk over it constantly. The ants harvest the fungus before it begins to sprout into mushrooms. They gather it and feed it to their larvae or eat it themselves. In this amazing colony, each individual type of ant works for the good of the group. And fungi are an essential element of these ants' survival. This symbiotic relationship benefits both the ants and the fungi. Nature is full of such relationships, and the survival of many animal, plant, and fungus species depends on them. <laughs>